So I'm just going to open the box now. Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be unboxing my brand new iPhone 11. I am so, so excited. I've wanted one for a very, very long time now. And I've got a student loan coming through very soon. I've also just been paid and I've been saving up quite a lot of money recently. And I thought, you know what? Let's just let's just go for it. Let's just spoil myself, buy it. I've wanted one for so long. My phone is very, very broken. It overheated and smashed. Well, the home button overheated and smashed and it's on charge. And then uh, the side buttons for volume also decided not to work. And it's just kind of that point where it's like, I feel like now is the best time for me to do this because I've not passed my driving test yet and I'm not going to pass it anytime soon because of all the virus and everything. So I feel like now's the best time because I'm not paying out, you know, a lot for my driving insurance, my driving lessons. I'm not paying out to go travelling for buses, for uni, for work, all that kind of thing. So I feel like right now is the best time for me. So anyway, let's just get on with the video. I just want to open my phone, to be honest. So I hope you enjoy this video. So I have taken the plastic seal off the outside edge, but that is literally it. I am super excited. We... I ordered this last night on Argos because I needed to go to Sainsbury's anyway today and the Sainsbury's has an Argos with it. I also had to go to Argos today for a new laptop wire for my laptop. Let's get a new charging wire for my laptop because I got crushed in the mechanical sofa last night which is really sad. Anyway, shut up. Stop rambling. Don't care. Like, I got this today. We queued. Um, for about half an hour to get into Sainsbury's and then we queued for over an hour to actually get into Argos it was one of them ones where the Argos is inside the Sainsbury's it was absolute madness so I'm going to open the box now this is the, like the best feeling in the world and I feel like an apple box opening up the box is like the best feeling ever so this is what it looks like inside oh my god it's so pretty and um, I love how they always like have a little tab so you can just take it out using the tab i'm also quite annoyed because i'm getting phone insurance for this one i never had phone insurance for one that i'm filming on now for my eight uh, i never got phone insurance for it because i just didn't bother i was like oh you know i just thought it was a waste of money but i've kind of decided now i am actually going to get phone insurance for this one because it was very very expensive and as well as that, I'm getting a new contract as well because I've got the most incredible contract deal right now I have, but I don't have signal in my area. So, yeah, I need a new contract because I don't have signal and I don't have 4G. And the Wi-Fi is really bad at home at the moment, so I'm kind of relying on my 4G. So, yeah, it's not great. But this is the phone. I've got, oh my God, I've got fingerprints on it already. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. I'm going to take this off now. That is real satisfying. That's, oh my god. That is so nice. Right, I'm going to look inside the box. I'll put that there for a bit. Okay. So this is what the inside of the box looks like now. And it's got a design by Apple in California. I think this is the instructions. Let's have a look. Yeah, that's the instructions. And then I don't understand why these come with Apple stickers all the time. But I've got about 50 of these now. Cool. Oh, we'll go back in. There we go. It's got that. And then, oh, this is like the best part about getting a new phone. I've got a plug. I noticed this when I got my MacBook that now they've stopped using the plastic coat and it's all paper, which I think is really good. <laughs> Helping the environment and all that. So I've got my plug. I just love getting a brand new iPhone charger. Best thing ever. I feel like I'm just going like, to store this one into my bed or something. And then I've got the wire for it here. I feel like I'm going to store this under my bed or keep it in the box because I'm forever losing and breaking iPhone chargers. And I feel like I just kind of want to keep this one nice and as like a backup. So, oh, with these, my new headphones, these are also like with the plug, how they've used paper packaging instead of plastic. They used to have the plastic headphone boxes. I don't know if you remember them. These have plastic headphone boxes. This one is a paper box i'm not actually getting that excited over paper it's just the fact that i think oh i quite like that as well when you open it that's what it looks like it's quite neat and organized again these need to be kept somewhere safe because i'm forever losing my headphones and breaking them but yeah i think it's really good how they're kind of going into more environmental stage of it 
and that is literally everything in my box it doesn't really come with much i remember when fun just come with like so much stuff like you know they come up with, like two different colored backs i was actually talking to my friend about that yesterday because she got the same phone as me and i'd already ordered mine um but we're talking about it well i was ordering it at that point and we're talking about it and i said i couldn't decide we both couldn't decide between the purple and the green because they're both so nice i think the purple's more classy and i just the purple's more me but i also really like the green um and i was saying like how the old samsungs used to actually have um exchangeable backs because before i went on to apple i used to have a samsung those were the days i did not enjoy i i'm not a massive samsung fan it's just me per my personal opinion is i'm more of an apple person at the moment but yeah i remember when you used to be able to take the backs off so you could have like a white back or a black back or a blue back or whatever colors they came i think mine was black and white i think that's what the colors they came in i might be wrong but yeah i remember those days they were good days we were saying it'd be good if we could do that with apple and have um a purple back and the green back but i'm really loving this so yeah this is my phone guys i'm super super excited to try this out i've never had a phone without like a home button before oh my god it's so fast and I think that the on button is like massive. If you look at the size of the on button there, it's not that easy to tell, but it's like two or three times bigger than my eights on button. I love the fact it's got two cameras on the back as well. Filming on this is going to be so fun because it's going to be like such good quality. Um, that's what my friend said as well about her new phone that apparently is really, really good quality as well. I'm so scared of dropping it. I don't have a case yet. I've got a free case um, coming from one of my PR things. I've got a free case actually on its way from Amazon. So... I'm just having to be very, very careful because I'm absolutely terrified of dropping it. That's like £800 down the drain. But I do think that after this video, if this video goes down well and all that, usual stuff, I think I'm going to try to do a, uh, not a review, but like a comparison video. So comparing it to my 8. So comparing like the size, the weight, the ability, the performance, things like battery life, you know, playing like 5 minutes, make a 60, which one goes down fast, that kind of thing. Just comparing the two taking photos on both filming on both the camera the audio like the microphone that kind of thing just comparing both phones and seeing which one i think is better and if it's worth the money if you are interested in that make sure you do keep an eye out for it and comment down below if it is something that you're interested in seeing but that is pretty much it for the video today guys it's just a small quick unboxing i hope you enjoyed it so i do hope you enjoyed this video today and i am now gonna go and geek out and have fun messing around and playing and setting up my new phone because it's like one of my favorite things to do is setting up a new phone it's so it's just so fun like putting all your music on it and doing all your settings and all that kind of thing it's fab but yeah i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you all next time bye guys so this is what the box looks like when it comes i've not actually opened this yet so i'm pretty excited to